guys, it's me Dulce. I'm here with my bullet journal. I'm gonna do a flip through of what I did for June. So here I go. Alright, so here we are, June. I use this really nice font. I don't know what it's called, but I really like the way this looks. Um, and then I used some watercoloring pencils and brushes to make this little splatter of paint there. I thought that looked cute. And for the monthly log, I just went really simple. Um, I've tried doing calendars, but there's never really much for me to put in it. So I think this is easier. I don't have that many things going on in my days. So it just makes it a lot easier for me. A lot less stressful. Not a, not a lot of work goes into this, so it's pretty easy. Um, I also decided to add an expenses page. As you see, I've already spent money today. I've been trying not to. Obviously, that's not going well. But yeah, I hope this will help me to spend less and really look at what I'm buying. But yeah. And I also added a YouTube section so I can write down some ideas or thoughts I have about the channel. And a gratitude section, so I'm just going to write down things I'm grateful for here. And hopefully I fill out most of that. I didn't want to use a whole page because I think it would be too much to do one for every day. And here's my next little section. It's called Two Lines a Day. I saw some other YouTubers doing this and I thought it was interesting. So for every day of the month, um, I'm going to write down two lines, or journal, two lines. I like that because it's not a lot of stress going into journaling and it's a good way to start. And I use these washi tapes here. I just layer them on top of each other, but I think that looks really cute. And for the first two weeks of June, the layouts, I just did them like this. Um, I like this, but I think the boxing is a little too much. I don't like doing that all the time. I like to be really simple when I do my bullet journal. Because it's just like a lot of pressure to make these look nice. And if you mess up, you, you know, kind of throws the whole thing off. And here I have the next two weeks after that. I like this one a lot because just basically you write the day and the date and you're set with some lines. That's pretty much it. Again, I use that washi tape. <laughs> and here's the last week. Um, since there's only five days, I just wrote the days of the week really large. Um, so I thought I could like, you know, do some bullets here on both sides I can use. But I like how this... But yeah, I like how this font looks. I didn't think I was a fan of it until I started doing it. And I did it on this other page over here. It's just really nice. It's a really nice way of making plain text look better. <laughs> but yeah, that was June. Um, I can show you what I did for May, I guess. Or uh, let's do April. I didn't do a lot in April. I filled some stuff in and then I fell off that week. May, I kind of did the same thing for my monthly, and I did a habit tracker in May, but I didn't stick to it, and I made like a large to-do list, but I think this was too large. Too large? So yeah, here was my weeklies. I had been journaling in here, and I was doing really good, you know, putting some cute quotes, some drawings, um, again. But then this last week, I kind of stopped, and then I just didn't even do the last week of May. That's because I had my sister come into town, but I think it's too much to journal like this sometimes. It's too much dedication, too much space. That's why I decided for June's weeklies, I was only going to do a page. And I have some space here so I can add stuff later on. I didn't feel like doing that yesterday when I filled this out. Um, but overall, I feel good about this one. Um, it takes a while for you to get to a place where you're super comfortable with something like even in the beginning of the year when I started doing it it was all very trial and error none of these really make sense to me anymore <laughs> um, but yeah I think bullet journaling is fun I recommend it to anyone if you feel like it'll help you get your life together or just get it organized or even for a creative outlet. That's why I really like this. But um, 
yep that's it for my June flip through hope you guys enjoyed it let leave me any questions if you have any uh, I'll see you guys next time bye